There we go. OBS decided it wanted to work. What's going on, everybody? How are you doing today? It's Drop the Gamer Dude. Welcome to you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Honestly, it has been interesting, interesting situations because on it, we were trying to get Saga Lock and everything to work, but it just was not wanting to work. It wanted to be stupid. Uh, not Saga Lock, excuse me. OBS. Uh, OBS wanted to be stupid, so it was not registering any of my clicks that I was doing, and it was just like, yeah, I'm gonna be bad. Hi, Ugo Blip. Speaking of things that are really annoying and. Not wanting to work well. <laughs> Damn, I roasted. You. Joy will appreciate it. Roasting of the roasting of the Oogle Blips. Um, honestly, that could be a, that would be like a song, you know, like Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairies, like you know, Dance of the Roasting Oogle Blips. Like it works, right? Like it'll just pop out. Like uh, oh, God. I want popcorn now. Dang it! <laughs> I want overcooked popping out oogle blips i wish i was good at animation because i would definitely make a random thing of that it would be bad but it would be funny okay hi this is a pokemon i do not do not like dealing with uh actually well i say that i don't like dealing with it but i think i can deal with it it's normal and psychic type so as long as it doesn't, like, try and hit me with something stupid, we're fine. Yeah. Okay, that works. So, so actually, isn't Meloetta the only... No, 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 no. Indeedy, 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 Indeedy. Indeedy is also normal and psychic. I was like, I'm glad I caught myself on that, because I was like, I think that is a false statement now. It's weird, though. So, like, a lot of these Pokemon, like, you think about them, and you're like, wow. They actually were so good, and they were the, not good, but, like, they were the trendsetter. They were the mon that you look at, and you're like, wow. Like, they were the first. Like, it, and it's all, it's, it's not always going to be first. I mean, we learned that by Adam Schefter being dumb and being like, Tom Brady retired, by the way, without Tom Brady actually retiring. Um, like, at all. Like, they tried to break the story of, like, Brady retiring and all this stuff, but he had, yeah, never retired, and it's just like, really? Like, I could not imagine. Oh! Oh, no! Apparently, don't shout on Shafter. Oh, even Pokemon's protecting Adam Schefter? Bruh. Like, ah. Uh... <laughs> what the heck? Whoa, did it have to be Hercules? Uh... No. Of all Pokemon, like, ah. Uh... That's so sad. Like, of all Pokemon, I don't even know what to add. Uh, Hercules was meant to go against Psychic types and then failed against the Psychic type. I should have Aqua Jetted. I was dumb. It, but we, we'll, we'll live with that mistake. And of course, it was a crit, too. Because it, it the crit the crit or the non crit didn't matter. It was, def, it was literally because of a crit. Which, I mean, I'm not surprised that's how you play this game and I knew a crit was risky and then that it was being risked but like there I also knew that there was nothing else I could do realistically against the Meloetta oh at least I know Meloetta now does not have a great move set it's growl fire pledge and telekinesis so I don't know the fifth or the fourth move but three of the four are bad so that does help. Oh, what are you gonna turn into? Grass type, probably. Grass type, probably. Ghost type. Oh, wait. Actually, that's good. That is actually great. That I re I was like, wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. You're a grass type now. Now you can't do much. Ha ha ha. And another gosh diggity darn Absol. Can we just not with them and say we did with them? Like Absols are making me mad. What Pokemon makes you the most mad? Uh, let me know in the comment section below. Like, I mean, I know Joy's answer is Oogle Blip. Correct me if I'm wrong. But Oogle Blip and Trojan and stuff like that. Is, like, it's always the Pokemon, that, the Pokemon that carry with you, right? Like, for me at least. It's the Pokemon that carry with me. It's like, but like, 
why do you want to be with me and why are you carrying over to these things and these generations? Whew. So that's kind of how it, it feels to me is like trying to figure out how to alleviate that and get that get rid of that. But no, today um, our plan is to go all the way through kind of, oh my god, can we not? Our plan is to get through this like celestial tower so that way we can move forward by then getting onto the gym leader in episode 139. Which honestly is just crazy that we're almost there. Like we are getting ever so close to that mark, that 139 episode. And it's just like, I refuse to believe how close we are. Meow, 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 meow. Um, apparently she's a cat, you know, live your best life as a cat uh, but yeah like it's crazy like I don't think we should be this this far but we are and we're evenly training the team getting the train the team like kind of making its way I think the ace is like 39 for this next gym so that's why like I, like I, I the team feels comfortable right and I like that the team is in a position of comfortability Except for we literally just lost them on, but I don't. I don't even know who to add to the team. Like straight up, I think I have an option. I think I know who I'm adding to the team. Is it a weird choice? Of course it's me. Of course I'm making the awkward and weird choices. But is it worth it? Potentially. I just got to know what level the thing involves at, which I'll look up now. Um, that just tells you it's one of the non-fully evolved Pokemon on my team, or on the. The docket here but I think it was like 33 so like I don't need to know when it evolves to what level 31 I was close I was not right, but I was close. A troll! Uh, troll's been such an amazing... Like, I can't wait. I, I literally almost spoil things. But, you know, I, I, I just love to spoil things. Y'all know that. I'm going to spoil literally anything and everything I can spoil uh, when it comes to my content. Balmy mushrooms. Would you in, Would you eat a balmy mushroom? I, I personally would not, but would you eat it? Like, that is the question. Um... Yeah, no, I would not. I don't think I could possibly even think about eating a balmy mushroom. Like, no, I don't. I don't need to do that. I, I, I really, I really wouldn't need to do that. That's not like Troy's. Let, okay, yeah. Ugh. Do I even have a flying type in the box? That's a good question. I don't think I have a flying type in the box. Troy, get poisoned. <laughs> I, I need a toxic orbit fast. Like, that's going to be the item that I need the most. Like, if I can get that, Troy's getting the toxic orb. We just haven't found one, and it's really sad because it's, like, literally the item that if we get it, Troy becomes so much better than he already is. So it's like, come on, Troy, you got this. But we have not. Also, there's so... Oh, I, I'm going to start... I'm literally going to start to use my repel. I actually am going to go ahead and use it now because I'm, I'm just using that as an opportunity to speed up and I'm realizing how dumb that is because it's literally like I could repel and not worry about it. Smoke screen. What a freaking god tier TM. Isn't that right? Imagine if there was a move that allowed you to toxic yourself. That would be crazy. Like there's a move that lets you put yourself to sleep. It's like it wouldn't be too far out of the realm of possibility to have that be a thing because there's a move that puts you to sleep well actually no there's literally only a move that puts you to sleep um so never mind that is really out there and out of the realm of possibility but you know what i tried <laughs> oh it's queen i gotta switch out because uh twiddly gets wrecked by queen like badly wrecked by queen so we go to kaiba boy like, and I guess I really think that our team is going to reach level 39 apiece by the end of this episode. I think that that is definitely a possibility. 
um, especially if I use Kaiba Boy correctly, um, then that is definitely feasible. Uh, am I nervous? Oh, no, 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 I'm lucky that killed, because yeah, like I said, if it didn't kill, we'd be in a very big predicament. And that is not a predicament that I am really wanting to be in right now. Like, losing more Pokemon than we already have in the first five, ten minutes of the episode. We're at uh, ten minutes right now, but... Oh wait, pressure just literally says, hey, I'm, I got pressure. I forgot about that. I So then, whatever, I think I said something, I, th I definitely did say something that I pressure before, and it actually didn't have pressure. Oh, well, you know, good to know. Oh, it's Torterra. I was like, oh, Torterra has pressure. And it's like, no, it actually doesn't, John. Like, that's not how pressure works. But, good attempt. A mental herb. Oh, wait, does he fight me now? Yeah. Who, uh, uh, as consequence, we're picking up your mental herb. I'm gonna break your mental stability. <laughs> okay. It's not like that's already been broken many times before. Many times over. So, that doesn't phase me at all. With your level 37 Roselia that literally sits and does nothing. Yep, nope, you're definitely breaking my mental stability. Um, but again, the only thing I've handled grass types is with Joy. Or not Joy, Troy. Um, and that is the nerve-wracking portion of this, right? Because, like, yeah, there's no full apples, which is great and fine and dandy. But also, it's not like we're making things easy on ourselves by type coverage just being long. And not only that, y'all are killing a Pokemon suit anyway, so you guys could literally kill anything you want to. Uh, well, you guys have to really confer with Tarant because Tarant got plus freaking eight, so Tarant has nine votes. So if you don't, like, Tarot has such a big say, I am super nervous for him. Uh, because I'm like, if they end up doing what I think they're going to do, I'm going to be sad. I, 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 I am going to be extremely sad if what I think happened is going to happen. Um, I really think that, I say that and I'm like, well, really any Pokemon, but whatever new Pokemon I'm going to add to the team, I'm going to be sad if it dies, though. Like... Yeah, some are going to hurt more than others, but that's literally any Nuzlocke. Some Pokemon are going to hurt more than others. You're just a fight. You're pure fighting right now. Another type I really can't handle. Make us break a Tweedledee. We'll learn a Psychic type move. But, you know, that's fine. It's fine, Tweedledee. Oh, wait, it's super effective. It is dark fighting still. <laughs> Oops. Well, that's fine. Uh, yeah, still, Tweedledee legitimately needs some fixing because Tweedledee <coughs> sits and legitimately like sits and is just like okay like I exist here for now but not for long it's just like Tweedledee chill and you'll get there like you'll do what you need to but oh wait isn't the, isn't the gym that I'm fighting you have to actually fight the guys like you can't skip the guys in the gym that's raw oh shh. oh god i literally was thinking about this pokemon in my car today or yesterday no it wasn't yesterday it was the day i was hanging out with joy which would have been tuesday my brain went what if I encounter a Zekrom? That's like the hard counter to my entire team. Joy's dad! Come save my freaking life! Because you're the best dad in... Um... Yeah. You're the best dad in the state of Michigan. There! There we go! I was trying to figure out a way to say that, like, where I wasn't, like, completely dogging 
my family too, because I like my family. But also, like, Joy's dad's amazing, so like, it gives credit to both. There we go. I figured out a way. I thought about it. Okay. Oh, you dropped the Draco immediately. Okay. If I got it. everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's ah! Holy crap! Oh, oh my god! Whoa! Oh, the Joyce Dad is the best Pokemon to handle this, too. Every other Pokemon. Oh my gosh. Tackle. What? Why do you have ta tackle? Tackle. Okay. Go to sleep. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god. 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 Okay. Go to sleep. 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 Good. You're at least asleep. I was slower, so you're asleep this turn for sure. Because that, that's how sleep works. I know you're asleep this turn for sure. So I'm going to leave seed you now. You little... Of course you have a full heal. Why Why was it, Why was did I expect nothing less? Okay. How much health do I get for that? For the leech seed. Okay, I get a decent chunk, actually. So, I'm going to play the Super Potion, so I'm not wasting Hyper Potions. That'll be at 96. Okay, you're at minus 4, so you're going to go to minus 6. And you fucking crit. You fucking son of a bitch. I fucking just... I'm about to have a kill episode! The last thing I need is to rebuild the mother freaking team! Oh! What do I even send in? Everything else... Oh my god... I can't even believe it crit. Because again, that's the second time in this episode that I've died to a crit and having the crit matter. But the crit mattered literally on any Pokemon. So... And then, of course, her having a full heal did not help anything. If Tweet Tweedledee's not doing half, right? No, not even close. Oh, God. Come on, Tweedledee. Tank this at least a little bit. Yeah, like, uh, look at that. Look at that. That it would have done less. It would have done less to Joy's dad. Legit, it would have done less than to Joy's dad because it's a minus five, uh, four at that point. So, but the crit mitigates the stat debuffs. So that is how, gosh darn much of a difference that crit made. Oh, of course it had to be Joy's dad. I literally just complimented him. Uh, game. Oh. Fuck. Me. I'm out of storm throws too. Why did it have to be a nurse that has this? Because the, the nurse is the only one that's gonna heal like this. Ah. Uh. I can't close combat. Cause that's not gonna kill. And then I invite myself to die with Tweedledee, and I can't do that. Or I shouldn't do that, I should say. But that might actually be my only realistic option. Because I've only seen two moves this thing has. If this thing is an electric move, by Brittany, by Kaiba Boy. Like, yeah, I'm at minus six, but it could be like... Thunder Punch or something like that. And that's still gonna. It's it, it's Tweedledee. That's my thought process here. It's Tweedledee. I love her, but also 
I'm not gonna be so mad. Oh, Dragon Pulse. That's fine. Yeah, I wasn't gonna be upset if Tweedledee died. Which she didn't. Only Joy's dad did. Which makes me sad because I wish the roles were reversed. But I have to go up another floor. Oh, freaking of course it happened to be that way. And then she heals afterwards. Not like, you know, Joy's dad is dead and Heracles is dead in the same freaking episode. Oh, okay. Freaking. I have a team of four right now. And I do not like that one bit. I am definitely not a fan. Oh, shoot. There's, like, even more, too. Okay. Oh, God. Okay, and I have to fight both of the trainers up here. And then I get to ring the bell. And then I can go fight the gym. Oh, my God. Dude, there's going to be so much training. Like, oh, my. I just, Yeah, I just thought about that. I literally have to train up two mons up to level 30 freaking 7 or 8 or 9. Probably 9 if all of these Pokemon are up there. But, like, of course it had to be a Zekrom, and of course it had to crit, right? Like, because we did live a Draco Meteor at full. And it, we were definitely living, in most other cases, Wild Tweedledee. Hi, you're level 40 already. Remoraid. Okay, so who I gotta send... I have to have Kaiba Boy be the front then, because freaking Tweedledee got to level 40. <laughs> and then Kaiba Boy will literally be the only Pokemon that are, is not higher level. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. We missed a stone edge. And... Oh. I can't risk missing a step. This episode! Like, I don't want to... I, I, the problem here is if I heal, I'm risking a crit anyways. So, I'm risking... I mean, yes, I'm risking a four... Okay. Here's the risk is. Risk is. Risk is. Whatever. I'm risking a 4% crit. Or a 20% miss. So the better play would be to heal. Or I smack down. And try and do... I'd have to hope that I do a lot of damage though. Because 150 base power did about 60 health. So I would have to hope that I do for oh I do 40% with SmackDown for sure. Okay, we're fine. See, it all it takes is a little bit of math, because yeah, not even a crit kill. Good. SmackDown's 100 percent accuracy. Let's use that. Oh, I need to stop using freaking Stone Edge because I miss that way too often and that almost risked a life I didn't need to risk there. You know, I would be excited about that. If only that came literally sooner. Any second sooner would have been better game. Not when Joy's dad is dead because he didn't have a ground move to take care of the freaking Zekrom. Uh, this game is just... You know what? It's, it's really being what the game needs to be. Which is annoying because I'm sure it's getting boring with no Pokemon dying and things going smooth, seemingly smooth. Oh, only Troy can learn it anyway, so does it really matter? No, because Troy's not a freaking special attacker. Um... But Earth Power is a good TM that I gotta keep uh, tabs on because that that will help us significantly. Um, hi, I didn't mean I. There was a thing that I didn't take care of. Oh, it's a cactus. It's a storm throw. We're good. We're fine. Cactus and frail. Oh no! Oh my god! That could have been so bad! It wasn't, we were fine! But 
that could have gone so horribly wrong. It has anger point. And I used a move that guaranteed crits. <laughs> I gotta keep him at the amount of that one. Whenever you see Jonas's, they can get angry very fast and absolutely destroy you. Good to know. Oh my gosh, game. Stop, this is too scary. Hi, I'm Skyla. I had you go up here and kill all your Pokemon. So that way my fight would be easier with you because you actually were a good trainer. And I like the fact that you lost two Pokemon. Well, I don't, Skyla, okay? You're gonna make me go down the mountain, aren't you? Okay, no, you're not. I can actually just go back to Mistralton. Good. Good. And now I get to I end the episode by saying farewell to one of my favorite Pokemon in the entire series. Which is actually really sad. Oh, I gotta take... Can I... Wait, can I take the item? No, I can't. I'll do that later. Okay. Bye, Joy's dad. Bye, Hercules. I should put you in the order, but you died because that'll trigger me. Okay. So what the frick are we doing? <laughs> okay. So... We lost a dark type and a grass type. Stench. You're gonna evolve soon, but oh my god, your uh, your freaking move set is bad. Why? Why is your move set so bad? So with it with its moveset being bad Party Pokemon. We have physical attacker, special wall, physical attacker, physical attacker. We need a special attacker. Which we kind of don't have on the team at all. None of the Pokemon of Cod are specially attacking except for Shelter. What is our main weaknesses right now? We are weak to... Or we don't have coverage for grass. Or good coverage for grass. And Zekrom. So we need a ground type. Which we don't have. But we can't add more weakness to Zekrom. So I'm going to add the Venonat or the Whirlipede. Because Whirlipede evolves at level 30 anyways, I believe. What level does Whirlipede evolve? Yeah, 30. So, I, I want to add Mary. I think Mary is a good idea. Mary could be a good idea. Or, actually... Z, Pokeblock Trainer Z would not be bad either. Um, you know what? Actually, I'm adding Pokeblock Trainer. Well, no. Because it's like adding the same Pokemon again that I've had before. But, like. Z is so much better than a bomb of snow, though. Yeah, no, no, sorry, but it, uh, hey, it's a it's a byproduct of what the game has given me. So we're adding Cradilly, and then now it's what do I believe in more between Warlapede and Venonat, which of course is already a great decision to be made. We got red. Red is going to be physically attacking. 
and Venonat, what is the stat differentiation? I know this is a weird question to ask ourselves, but how does the stats look like for a Venonat versus a Scolipede? Because I know Scolipede is a great Mon, but also it doesn't fit. And they're both going to be the same typing, so typing-wise, that doesn't matter. But what's going to fit our team more? I think a Venom... Or not a Venonat. Uh, a, uh, what, a Venomoth is going to fit our team better. Venomoth. 450 base power. It's got 90 base special attack. At 70, 65, 60, 90, 75, 90. So that's not bad. And Scolipede has 100 base attack and 112 speed, but is not defensively rounded. Ah, as much as I hate to do this, I think Venonat's better. I love Scolipede, it's one of my favorite bug types, but Venonat, though, I gotta hope that Venonat can learn some good moves, though, because if Venonat can't, I made a big mistake. Because this has an actually mediocre move set, whereas the Venonat has a trash move set. I might have risked it for the biscuit, and I don't. I have to at this point. I love you all, and I won't be recording another episode because this episode was just too sad. I'm gonna train up, and we're gonna fight Skyla in the next episode. Love you all, and good night. <laughs>